Hey guys, Case of Manitoles here. Today I'm going to show you how to end a non-responsive program with a batch file. This is most effectively used for ending a non-responsive task manager because that's what you would use to end other non-responsive programs, but you can't because it's not responding, obviously. So um, what you're going to want to do is open up a notepad, hold down the win button and press R, and type in notepad.exe and click OK. This is what will pop up. Okay, now click um, right here. And what you're going to want to type in is this right here. Um, I'll put that in the description for you to read. So, and copy and paste. So, yeah, right there. Copy that in. And now what you want to do is the task that's not responding, you want to put that right here. So, just to show an example, I'm going to do notepad. So, paste that right there. File. Save as. Now I'll save it to the desktop, call it stop. Now this is the important part. At the end of what you name it, type .bat. That makes it a batch file. Click save. You see, and you see that right here. That's what pops up. Now X out of that. And yeah. Now let's run another notepad. And here you see this is what happens when you double click it. It ends the process. That process is ended. You can also see it in the task manager. Um, let's try this again. Let me show you that. Now you see this right here, notepad pops up. Now double click that, it's gone, see, it disappeared. So there you go. Um, another thing you might want to do, if you ever want to edit the batch file, just uh, right click and click edit. You can change what executable that you want to uh, end. We can try my rocket doc, let's see if we can get that to end. You should be able to, you should be able to do anything. Um, click save, X, double click that, my rocket doc's gone. So there you go, guys. That's how you make a uh, batch file that will end any executable program with that special code. Again, that code is right here. Yeah. So um, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, any questions um, on this code, or if you can't get it to work right, you can send me a PM on YouTube. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.